Good morning and welcome back to week four of the online Darts Live League, phase two. And this week is the last opportunity for three players to qualify for the week five, which is Champions Week, of course, where £10,000 in prize money is up for grabs. And a not to be sniffed at £5,000 to the winner. Well, that person will be crowned next Saturday night. But another week of darts and another week of action and another week of World Masters champions to bring you. Including the man in the back of shot there, John O'Shea, the current Wimble World Master. Oh, that long ago, back in 2019. He will be defending his title in December in the Netherlands. And there's a former WDF World Cup winner, Keelan Kay. First leg, it's John to throw first. Game on. Well, interestingly, the, the odds for the winner of this Group A, more about Group B and Group C in a moment, Kevin Burnett, six to five, of course. Uh, one back to back. Richie Burnett, seven to two. Sean McDonald, four to one. 84. Robert Thornton, six to one. John O'Shea, seventeen to two. Keelan Kay, twenty to one. Well, eighty-five. I think that's six to one. About Robert Thornton is way too big. John O'Shea was the one to two favourite. To win this match. Always a little volatile, of course. 100. Trying to work out the winner of these early matches. All the matches, best of seven, first of all, two points for a winner. The winner of this group, 58. which will be concluded Wednesday afternoon, will go through to. Saturday night's final. 92. Players finishing in second and third will go into Thursday's Group B. Four, five, and six will be back for Group C on John, you require Thursday 84. and Friday morning, which will see Corinne Hammond, Reese Robinson, and Aaron Monk join in the field. And 34. then Thursday and Friday nights, Group B. Mark Webster, 42. James Richardson and Rob Collins. My goodness. Good luck to the three players that eventually come through this group to make next week's Champions Week. 18. John, you require 50. For a hold of throw and 1-0. Oh, dear. Missed the big number. Three for double 16. 18. Oh, what a chance for Keelan K. Keelan, you require 24. To pinch one early. 18. Game shot on the first leg. Keelan K. Keelan K does pinch one in the opening leg of this week four. An 18 dart breaker throw. Missed opportunities for John O'Shea. Second leg, it's Keelan to throw first. But still, game on. Plenty of darts to be played in this one. John O'Shea's scoring will be the problem here for Keelan K. He may outfinish him, but I don't think he's going to outscore him. Already into 100. Champions Week. Martin Adams, Colin Osborne, and a Saturday night's winner, Conan Whitehead. Congratulations to Conan. 58. We also have those that have finished runner-up in Scott Marsh, Jared Cole, and Niall Cullerton. 60. Joe Davis, and Charles Barstow, and Jamie Clark, of course, all winning the third and fourth Playoffs. 180. Well, the commentator's curse, alive and well, did suggest that. I didn't think Keelan Kay was going to outscore him. And he hits the first max. Yeah, so the, the 
winner this week obviously will progress and the runner up and the third and fourth playoff winner and then we will have champions week my pal paul nicholson enjoying a much needed week's rest he will be back for that next week 60. keelan you require 71. the six players in this group obviously these two and then we have sean 31. mcdonald Robert Thornton, Kevin Burness, and Richie Burness. A real, Richie Burnett, a real tough, tough group. 130. Good pressure from O'Shea. Leaving the choir, 40. Game shot on the second Finds leg. the double ten. Leland K. An 18-dart opening leg, a break of throw, is followed by a very comfortable-looking 17-dart holder throw, and Keenan K halfway there. Leads 2-0, needs leg. two it's more to, to pick up his first two Game points on. of the day. Must-win leg here for O'Shea. 140. One hundred. One hundred and forty. John O'Shea, the last winner of the World Masters, of course. And it didn't didn't happen 81. last year. Another two former winners, of course, in the group today. Robert Thornton, 85. a winner in 2007, where he beat Daryl Fitton 7-5 in the final. And, of course, 58. Richie Burnett, John, you back in 1994. Beating Steve Beaton 3-2 in the final in 100. that one. He nearly, very nearly defended the title, of course, Burnett, losing in the final to Eric Claris the following year. 39. John, you require 36. Game shot on the third leg. John and O'Shea. A much needed hold of throw for John O'Shea. As I said, a must win leg, 3 0 down. It's pretty much done and dusted. However, fourth leg. back it's in the match now. To throw first. Game on. Best leg of the match there for O'Shea. 180. Oh, second. 180 for Keelan K. Expected the maxes to come from this man. 60. Fifty eight. One hundred. Keelan Kate was a, a fairly big outsider in a two horse race for this one, six to four. Forty three. Richie Burnett against Sean McDonald. Ninety-one. We'll follow, and then Kevin Burness against Robert Thornton make up our six for this very exciting Group A. One hundred. That leaves tops two one eighties in the leg. And a thirteen darter from O'Shea. Oh, Keelan K has left tops after twelve in this leg four. Sixty. Keelan, you require forty. Game shot on the fourth leg. And it is Keelan K. a 13 dart leg for Keelan K, and he leads 3 1, needing just one more leg. And of course, we'll have the darts in leg Fifth six leg. if he can't it's get it done in leg five. Game on. John O'Shea. 93. Doesn't have to just worry about holding throw here, has to break throw, of course. Has to break back, should 45. I say? 
can go missing, Keelan K. So O'Shea's got to just stick in there. 100. One hundred and thirty-four. Shea defeated the very impressive Scott Waits in the final of that Wimbledon World Masters back in two thousand and nineteen. One hundred. Such a wonderful tournament. Such history. Fifty-seven. Nineteen seventy-four, of course, was the very first Wimbledon World Masters. 140. The great Cliff Inglis defeating Harry Heenan in the final. 900 pounds. John winner. requires 60. Cop for that one. 8. On par with modern Game BDO prize money. But that John is O'Shea. a 15 darter from O'Shea to go within just one leg now. Biggest leg of the match. Well, up next, and he'll hold a throw here from Keelan Six Kay, it's Keelan and he defies first. the odds. Game on. One hundred and forty. Averages, 92 for O'Shea, 90 for Kay. 129. 100. 100. Great, Alan Evans, who didn't win. 58. As many majors as probably people think he should have done, won the Second ever World Masters in 75. Defeating 91. another Welshman in the final. And of course started the the five from Bristow winning in 77, 58. 79, 81, Keelan, you require 83 and eventually defended it in 84. And then the great Dave Wickham 85 and then Bob Anderson doing that incredible treble. 122. He without doubt was the best player in world darts at that time, 80, 86, 87, 88. Keelan, you require 48. 32. Two match starts then. For Keelan K. John, you require 156. Has to go. Needed two trouble 20s and double 18. 82. 82. Keelan, you require 16. 16. Game, shot. And, and the match. Holds on Keelan to K. that break of throw and then holds throw to win in leg number six. And pulling off a bit of surprise there. Keelan K winning that match 4 2. There's the averages 90.89, 88.08. Not bad at half nine in the morning. And of course, those three 180s for Keelan K. Right, we're going to be straight back with Richie Burnett against Sean McDonald.
Good morning and welcome back to match number two of 15 we'll be bringing you today. And it features Richie Burnett against Sean McDonald. Good opening win for Keelan Kay. Picking up two points and a defeat for John O'Shea, despite averaging 90.89 to Keelan's 88.08. Sean McDonald, of course, has been involved in the live league before. And here's Richie, 1995 world champion, of course, the 1994. World Master, but back to McDonald. Played 23 matches. Oh, no. Former World Youth Masters winner, 35. He did tell me I played him in Holland. Around about 15 years ago. I need to look up the result for that one and I'll let you know what happened. But he played 23 matches so far in the... Online Darts Live League, 114. A best average of 98.43, but a running average of 88.44. Absolutely rock first. solid. Game on. 21 180s in his 23 matches. So if you're, if you like playing the 180 markets, I think they... 100. Like I say, early doors... You have to be a little careful. Some players take a, a bit of time to get going, but in this match, Sean McDonald, 8 to 13, over 0.5. And on average, it's one a match. Keep, out, keep an eye out for that uh, during the day. One hundred. Richie Burnett's strike rate is way more than that. Hence, they go over 1.5 for Burnett. 6 to 5, which a bit skinny at this time of the morning, in my opinion. 100. The odds on this one, even money, McDonald. 8 to 11, Burnett. 43. Richie can be a bit of a slow star starter. Forty-three. One hundred and forty. One hundred and forty. Richie, you require one hundred and eighteen. Eighty-two. Sean, you require seventy-eight. Game shot on the first leg. Sean Takes McDonald. Out the 78 in two darts. Trouble 18 for double 12. And very much like Keelan Kay gets an early break of throw. And we know how that second worked leg. out it's for to throw first. John O'Shea. So Richie Burnett already a bit to do. The 14 darter for... 100. Sean there to break through. One hundred and forty. Fifty eight.
95. One hundred and forty. Thirty. Richie, you require one hundred and twenty six. Well, this is for the break back. Eighty. One hundred and forty. Richie, you require forty six. Thirty. Ernie, double trouble for Richie. Jordan this would hurt if the one one fives converted by McDonald. Bullseye. Ooh. Seventy four. Richie requires sixteen. Oh, that was in. He was walking. Game you can go the now. Leg. Richie Burnett. And that's a good response for Richie. A few missed doubles in that leg, but ultimately it's a 17 dart break of throw. And we're back on throw at one apiece. Third leg. It's Richie to throw first. Game on. Unlike O'Shea, he couldn't get the break back. Richie does it straight away. 60. One hundred and eighty. The first of the match, and it goes to Burnett, starting to warm to the task. Ninety four. One hundred and twenty three. On as the one eighty up with a one, two, three, another three trebles. One hundred. Richie, you require one hundred and thirty-eight. Sort of burst onto the scene in O2, winning the World Youth Masters, Sean McDonald, and then ninety-four went missing for a couple of years, and then re-emerged in O6 and played O6, O7, and then fell out of love with the game. One hundred and forty. Richie, you require forty four. Thirty six. Oh dear, oh dear, Richie. Two darts. Sean, two, you require one. eighty six. To hold throw. And he's letting Sean McDonald in again on this eighty six. He was clinical on the seventy eight in leg one. Double seven. Big yawn there from Richie. Seventy nine. 
Richie, you require eight. Chasing the doubles around. Game shot on the third leg. Eventually finds the double one. And, well, I'm not sure if it's a, a celebration or well, an outpouring of frustration, but it is Richie who leads 2-1. Fourth leg. It's Sean to throw first. Game on. Our first hold of throw. One hundred and thirty four. Eighty five. Sadly, I can't find any details of our of our game. don't remember him from back in the day. Like I said, he was only briefly around in 06, 07, playing PDC darts. One hundred and eighty. That's a second max for Burnett. Players averaging around a very respectable 90, 90, 92, 38 to be exact for McDonald. And he trails 2 1 and could be going behind 3 1 here. 180. Hmm. Equaling the 3 1 8 is Keelan K in match one. And he does have a fabulous strike rate 58. on the 180s. I'm just always a little Richie bit wary of the players playing their first matches. It was 6 to 5 over 1.5, and he's covered that in 36. four legs. <laughs> Do get some wonderful reactions from Richie. One hundred. Richie, you require twenty. Game shot on the fourth leg. Richie Burnett. Tidy leg there from Richie with back-to-back -back one eight is in it. It was a sixteen dart break of throw. He leads three one and is in complete control. Fifth leg. It's Richie to throw oh, no. first. Game on. Will we get a fight back? Or will Richie? Just run this one out. 80. Thirteen darter there to break throw for Richie. Averaging 93.71. McDonald 90.42. 140. Tidy start to the day. Fifty-five. Richie, of course, was our winner in our special, which was a precursor to the launch of Phase 2. Yeah, she defeated, well, Robert Thornton came second, 95. Martin Adams third, Fallon fourth, and fifth and sixth was Aaron and Aaron Monk and Jason Askew. But winners... So far of phase two, Martin Adams week one, the very impressive Colin Osborne in week two, and Conan Whitehead was our champion on Saturday night. One hundred and forty. Don't forget, we are broadcast live on Sporty, Tuff, Sporty Stuff TV. On Thursday, Friday, and Saturday evenings. 60. Channel 437. Sean, you require 126. Mm. 
94. 32 left after 12. Richie will get will get another chance, of course, with throw. 145. Sean if require 32. McDonald takes the 32 out. That's a great guide. Game shot on the fifth leg. Sean McDonald finds the double eight. It's a 15 dart breaker throw. And he still needs another break of throw, of course, but most importantly flag. is Sean's to hold here first. in leg six. Game on. A good response. The two legs he has won, McDonald. Both been breaks of throw and one in 14 and 15 darts. 45. Both players now averaging nigh on 94. One hundred. Fifty nine. One hundred and forty. Fifty-nine. The timing of the football today will be perfect for Sean McDonald, of course. I'm Robert Thornton. They both play each other at 1 p.m. That's their final matches. Scotland kick off at 2 o'clock against the Czech Republic in the Euros. Good luck to Scotland in that one. I did watch the Netherlands last night against Ukraine. My goodness. 68. What a game of football that was. Kevin Burness up next against 97. Robert Thornton. Kevin Burness, of course, won back-to-back -back weeks in weeks four and five. Richie Burnett, though, closing in on picking up his first two points of the day. And in impressive style, it has to be said. 78. Still averaging 94.1. Richie, you require 104. 100. Wales, of course, got off to a steady enough start in the football, drawing 1-1 with Switzerland, who can always 40. produce a bit of an upset. My pick for the Euros, Belgium, got off to a perfect start, winning 3-0 against Russia. 60. So, Richie 64 for Burnett 64. to wrap this one up. 4-2 and join Keelan K on two points with a plus two leg difference. 48. Sean, you require 132. So it's two points for a win, and leg difference will play its part, I can assure you, after three days. Players will play each other three times over the next three days. 92. Richie, you require 16. We'll endeavour to try Game and pick you shot. out. And the match. Richie Something Burnett. that stands out. 
please do gamble responsibly. No gamble there on the double eight from Burnett winning 4-2. Ended up with an average of 90.62, 86.02 for McDonald. Steady enough start, has to be said, from both, especially at this time of the morning. It's, well, seven minutes past 10 a.m. My goodness. Right, up next, Kevin Burness against Robert Thornton. <laughs> Welcome back to match number three of 15. Up next, Kevin Burness. He's quoted as a very lively 4-9 to nine favourite for this one against Robert Thornton, who is the 13-8 to eight, uh, shot. I can sort of understand it. Both, play, both players have played 60 matches. Kevin Burness has a running average of 90.65. Thornton, 87.33. A best for Burness of 117.20. A best for Thornton, 102.71. One eight is 76 for Thornton, 86 for Burness. It's a fairly big jump. First see. leg, it's Kevin to throw Where first. They're playing the 180 line. On. Yeah, they've uh, got this one sussed. 1.5. Over 2.5 in the match is 8 to 11. Now, if this was a little later... 140. Started with a 180, but I think that's, I think that's reasonably attractive. Like I said, I'd be more confident a little later after the 60. players have had a match or two. But certainly walk, watch out for that. 180 line. 60. Both players can be a little guilty of blowing hot and cold. 99. But Burness, definitely the more solid of the two. And 140. The more explosive. is more impressive in absolutely 100. every area. Kevin, you require 161. But the 4 to 9 didn't tempt well, not that I can have a bet, but wouldn't tempt me. 137. Tempt me in. I like the Burnett at 8 to 11. Forty-one. Robert Thornton had a Kevin very impressive twenty-four recent Super Series in Germany. Twelve. 
dominant leg so far from Burness. Burnett, uh, Thornton back on 201. One hundred and twenty five. Kevin, you require twelve. No score. Mm. Robert, you require seventy six. Right, this would be an absolute steal. And he loves tops. Game shot on the first leg. Robert Thornton. Somehow Thornton's come from absolutely nowhere. He was stranded on 201 when Burness was initially going for a double. However, Second leg, takes it's the 76 to out. Game on. And breaks throw in 18 darts. 99. So he was absolutely buoyed from that performance in Germany in the Super Series Players' Championship events. Not a tour card holder. But was high enough in the order of merit that with all the difficulties, people unable to travel. 98. He was called into play. He was due to be, well, of course, he was competing at the time down here in the live league. I think he played the opening two days. 59. And then got all his travel arrangements sorted. And then was on a plane to Germany. 100. Or maybe drove. Who knows? 134. 60. One hundred. Robert, you require one hundred and forty four. Yes. One hundred and four. Niederhausen, of Kevin, course. Kevin, you require sixty eight. Where Robert Thornton had a a very good four days in the 36. Super Series. Burness missing darts Robert, for the instant break 40. back. Yet again, Thornton on his Favourite tops. So close. 35. Frustration. Kevin, you require 32. Game shot on the second leg. Kevin Burness. And Burness does level things up and breaks back. So the opening two legs, both breaks of throw, very much replicating match number two between McDonald Third and leg. It's Burnett. Kevin to throw first. Game on. 60. 3 60. clear darts for Thornton there. Sixty. One hundred and forty. Yeah, Thornton made the round of thirty-two on one hundred day one of that super series. One hundred and twenty five. Before a wonderful 60. run to the semi finals on the final day of action, only being beat seven four by Dirk van Dyvenboda. One hundred and forty. Uh, had wins over Michael Smith, six three in the quarters. Ted Evitz in the last sixteen. Martin Schindler 100. in the round of 32. Robert, you require 36. Game shot on the third leg. Robert Thornton. And Robert Thornton breaks throw yet again. That's three consecutive breaks of throw in this one. I thought this would be not particularly one-sided. 
I Four certainly players. thought it's Burness to go first. Game on. would pinch it, which is why I didn't like the super short odds. One hundred and thirty-five. A full to nine. I don't think that's. I just didn't think 60. it was was realistic, especially the form, recent form that Thornton has been showing. As we know, this sport is played on confidence. You don't become technically one hundred and forty a bad player. Overnight, fifty-nine. You could struggle mentally with confidence, and that's all it's been. And of course. Robert Thornton's had lots going on 45. in his personal and private life. With caring for his wife, of course. Puts things in slightly 60. different perspective. Your priorities change, and rightly so. It looks to be on the road back. He's averaging 92 and a half here. Getting Burness 60. at it. But six Robert darts for three one. Talking of 90. shorter price favourites. No, I don't mind the next one. Burnett one to two against Keelan K six to four. Burnett Burnett, of course, getting off to a winning start. One hundred. Averaged over ninety. Robert, you require sixty. Fifty-two. Kevin, you require ninety-six. Could have won all these three legs so far. Well, all four of them, in fact. He had three darts to win leg two. Fifty-six. He's going to get another three Robert, darts here to win eight. leg four and move three-one up. To do's. Oh dear, Robert. Game shot on the fourth <laughs> leg. <laughs> what Robert a dart Thornton. that is for Robert Thornton to eventually get a hold of throw, or a first hold of throw in this match. Well, Burness was a big favourite. He's got to show us why. First. Game on. 21 dart hold of throw. But without doubt, 99. the most important hold of throw for Thornton in this match. Seventy-eight. Technically, Thornton looks absolutely no difference to when 97. he was winning the Masters and winning the UK Open. One hundred and thirty-seven. Ninety-seven. One hundred and forty. That's had some career, Thornton. As I said, the World Masters winner in 2007. Forty-five. And won the World Grand Prix. Robert, you require 146. In 2015, UK Open in 2012. Final of the Grand Slam in 13. 138. 140. Winner of the Portland Robert, Open back in eight. 2009. Game, shot, and mm. the match. Robert, Robert Thornton. Thornton does wrap it up with a 13 darter and comprehensive in the end. The leg he did lose. He had, of course, three clear darts to win it, an average of over 90. No 180s in that match, which is surprising when you think of their strike rate. But I did say you've got to watch them early. Up next, Richie Burnett against Keelan Kay.
welcome back. So after one cycle of matches, everybody playing the one match. Robert Thornton tops the table on two points plus three leg difference. Courtesy of that 4-1 win, of course. And Keelan Kay, uh, Richie Burnett in action here. Both two points plus two. Courtesy of winning both their matches 4-2. 19-year-old Keelan Kay lives down in Liscard, beautiful part of Cornwall, of course. Richie Burnett, Triocchi, Ronda Valley. Pretty sure he was from Kumpak. And that's where I used to pick him up, pick him up from when we used to go on our travels. First leg, it's Keelan to throw first. Game on. Keelan has the darts. Like I said, I like the one to two here. Not, not obviously a huge fan of the 140. short price favourites, but I just thought Burnett looked the better of the two in their opening matches. Both players hit three 180s. 96. Forty-five. But Keelan did get it his own get his own way with O'Shea. I think Richie will put up a little bit more resistance in this one. One hundred. Ninety-three. One hundred. What well, Keelan K to have over what well, just one one eighty or more, eight to eleven. One hundred and thirty-seven in his opening match. He doesn't often hit that many, but when a player tends to have his eye in on the lipstick, that will continue. So four to five over zero point five one eight is for Keelan K. That's my Keelan, you require 86. fancy in this one. I think this may have six legs in it. 78. So he's got Richie, you require potentially. 122. And if this match goes 4-2, which I expect it to, somewhere around there anyway. Got a single 18 ball. He wants the ball for a break of throw and a 10 plus finish. Our first of the 97. day. 97. Keelan, you require eight. It's close, wasn't it? Two twos, two ones. Richie smiling nose. Game shot there on you the go. first leg. How often Keelan does that happen? Wires the ball on the one, two, two for a break of throw and then watches the opponent. Take out double one with his final dart. But it is 1-0 to Keelan K. Throw first. And it's Game only on. a holder's throw. It was only 18 darts in the end. 60. It's just what it does mentally to Burnett. We have to be cautious of. 58. are watching via YouTube, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, hit the alert bell. 121. You get a notification every time we go live. If you are watching via your chosen bookmaker, I wish you all the, the best on your punts today. Like I say, if I see anything that stands out, it's not an opinion. All I've got here is reams and reams of data, and I'm just... Relaying that to you to try and 60. give you a bit of a heads up. Ninety-seven. 
98. The most common scoreline, by the way, is 4-2. 100. Average, there's 180 in every three legs played. 94. Richie, you require 160. She had 73 ton plus averages. Nine one seventies. One hundred and twenty. Keelan, you require one hundred and seventy. We've had two nine darters 60. in this phase two, of course. Richie, you require forty. Both by James Richardson. And he's in action. Game shot on the second in leg. Richie Burnett. Group B, Thursday and Friday evening, but Richie Burnett holds throw, levels things up at one apiece. Look out for that 180. The odds are now Third even leg. money Keelan for Keelan K just to Game get the on. one. Or one or more, should I say. 99. Fifth match coming up after this one. Robert Thornton. 100. Against John O'Shea. Looking forward to that one. Four to six about Thornton. Eleven to ten, O'Shea. One hundred. Both go into that one with a totally different mindset, of course. one. Richie frustrated. So far, 92. Just can't get any kind of consistency at the moment. 100. They're close, but no cigar, as the saying goes. 170. Well, that's a beautiful setup shot, isn't it? 170 to leave tops. I'm disappointed for those of you that 80. took my advice. 180 would have left Keelan, double 15. 40. And that would have covered that even money shot. Game shot on the third leg. But it's a Keelan 14 K. dart hold for Keenan K to add to the 18 dart hold in leg one. He now leads two legs to one. Richie Burnett, frustrated at the moment, needs Four to play. find to throw a little first. bit more Game on. consistency in the lipstick. 140. One hundred. Sixty five. One hundred and forty. Put you down to one sixty one after nine. Great to see the interest uh, 87. across the uh, internet of Check 83. the online darts live league. 65 Which you require pages of drivel on one forum. Wonderful stuff. Thank you, lads. Always gives me a, a good laugh. 121. Ninety 
93. He's left the big fish. Richie, you require 40. Will he get a go? Brunette hopes Game not. Game shot on the fourth leg. And that's a Richie 14 Burnett. dart response. Back to back 14 darts. Hold a throw from both players in legs three and four. Two apiece. I did suggest this one did have legs in it. It's going to get a minimum first. of six. Oh, Keelan K. Land that one 180 for you. Not looking like it. That's for sure. One hundred and forty. We've got a cork man in. John O'Shea. One hundred. Up next against Robert Thornton, big fan of the online darts league, of course. Gary Trampus from Cork. We're showing such 76. positivity, uh, not just towards the online darts live league, but Darts in general. Ninety six. Again, Richie fancies finding a break of throw, but just can't muster up the big scores. Needs to follow that. Does follow that. So he is going to get an opportunity here at one forty five. One hundred. Not too Richie much. Richie require one hundred and forty-five. In terms of urgency, Keenan K down to one two seven. Oh, Richie needs to find sixty. A treble. You can see the reaction. Keelan, you require one hundred. Need to add any colour to the commentary? I mean, just look at Richie. Then he'll tell you everything you need to know. So he'll be back at eighty-five. Seventy-nine. Richie, you require fifteen 85. for tops. Some players now like the fifty-seven for double fourteen, which I don't mind because you throw a lot more at the fifty-seven than you do at the forty-five. But that's a that's a woeful dart. Well, what a recovery! Double sixteen. Fifty-three. Almost. Keelan, you require forty-eight. Burnett. That is brilliant best there if he'd have found the 32. He wants tops. Game can't shot on the fifth it. leg. Again. Keelan K. Keelan K pinches one. Richie Burnett will be absolutely furious with that. But it is Richie to throw sixth first leg. in leg it's six. Richie to throw first. Game Still on. shaking his head. It'll fall off, Richie. Sixty. Sixty. All five legs going with throw. Sixty. Petulance from Burnett. He was always he's fun to watch, isn't he? Ninety-three. It certainly gives us value for money. One hundred and thirty-four. Fifty-eight. Fifty-nine. Thirty. So this looks like this one is going all the way. Even more surprising is the 180 not landing. One, oh, there's one. 
Let's from see. Richie. He'd like that in the next leg on the Keelan K throw. Oh, there you go. Go and collect. Richie, you require eight. It's over even money in the end. That's what we like. Richie Burnett. Uh, Richie Burnett likes that. An 18 dart holder throw. We're going all the way. And it will be Keelan K to have the darts in leg seven. Seventh and final leg. It's Keelan to throw first. Game on. Charlie calls to feet. Our referee in the online darts. 96. Live oh, darting lounge. Over here, covering the action. 100. Richard Ashdown doing the spotting. Great news, of 100. course. The WDF announcing that the World Championships. 100. Will be taking place January next year at the well, original home of World Darts. For so many years, I know it wasn't the original original. 145. Even that wasn't the original, of course. But anyway, it's going to be at Lakeside in January. As the PDC World Championships Keelan, you require is coming to the end, the WDF World Championships will be starting. 60. Richie, you require 161. That's a wonderful dart. I'd go ball here. 105. And the reason that is because he Keelan, you require will 100. or should get two darts at a double if K doesn't convert the 100. Tops, tops. If he'd have gone for a treble to leave a double there, Burnett, he could have had to use two darts to leave a double. By going for the ball in it in a 25, 45. it's left 56, which, of course, 16 Richie for tops, 56. 20 for double 18. There's the 16. Oh dear, Richie. 36. <laughs> oh, two match darts for Burnett. He can't believe it. Keelan, you require 55. I bet Keelan can't believe he's getting a go at this 55. I certainly can't. Game, shot, well, and the match. Well, well. Keelan K. I didn't see that one coming. And Keelan K picks up his second two points of the day. He moves on to four points and currently tops the table. As you can see there, Burnett, the better player in terms of averages. Almost six points more. More 140s, but that's where the damage was done. 27.27% on the doubles. A much more impressive 44% for Keelan K. And he does... Move on to four points. Robert Thornton and John O'Shea up next.
welcome back for match number five. Robert Thornton versus John O'Shea rattling through them this morning, as always. And Robert Thornton got off to the ideal start, of course, where John O'Shea got off to a losing start. He was one to two favourite, very much like Burnett was to beat Keelan Kay, but Keelan Kay prevailed in both those matches. Defying the odds, beating O'Shea 4-2 and then just beating Burnett 4-3. Burnett having match starts. Robert Thornton got off to a much better start. The best start of anybody. Winning 4-1. Fuses super darts. Well, they are sometimes, first John. Leg. That's it's for sure. Robert to throw first. Game on. Eighty-five. Robert was four to six. O'Shea eleven to ten. Sixty. One hundred. One hundred. Seventy. One hundred. Fairly healthy strike rate on the one eighties, having not hit one. One hundred and forty. In his opening match here, you can get eight to fifteen over naught point five. One hundred. Robert, you require one hundred and six. I expect Thornton to win the match. Ninety-eight. John, you require one hundred and forty-one. Certainly expect. O'Shea to make a fist of it. 47. Robert, you require 8. It's now 4 to 6 to hit 1 180. Game shot on the first As Robert, Robert Thornton wins the opening leg in 17 darts and very, very comfortable. John O'Shea didn't arrive here until late last night. Had a few issues second leg. with John uh, to throw first. logistics. Game on. So he's feeling a, a little jaded this morning. 97. 125. Sean McDonald back 96. in action against Kevin Burness. Now that's one that did stand out to me. When I was scanning through 140. all my deep data, and Kevin Burness at 8 to 11 against Sean McDonald. Well, I think that's my 140. pick of the day. Looking at all the stats available, that one shouldn't even really be close. 180. Well, Robert gets a 180. He was four to seven over 0 0.5 just before that. Um, One hundred and twenty-eight. O'Shea is too low to have a go six. at the 180. As Thornton wants tops for 12. Game shot on the second. And he leg. finds the Robert tops, Thornton. and that's a 12 dart break, a throw, a very impressive leg from both. O'Shea leaving a double after 12 darts, not getting a go. Due to the prolific to throw first. leg Game of scoring. On. One, two, five, one forty, one eighty, and out in fifty six. 
for the 12 dar it wasn't at 11 of course here comes the max there you go go and collect beautiful One hundred and forty. One hundred. Not an opinion. These are just looking at all the stats in front of me. One hundred and at the moment, averaging 104.36, Thornton 104.83. 125. Being played Robert, at some pace, suiting both. He stayed there, I don't blame him, like the light. 110. John, you require 96. Triple 20, double 18. He should stay there, that's a good guide. Double 8. Game shot oh, super stuff. Leg. From O'Shea. O'Shea, a 12 dart break, a throw in leg two from Thornton. Well, O'Shea responds, a 180 of his own and a lovely 96 checkout, as clean as Fourth they leg. come. John to throw first. Game on. Was in the most impressive part, that first dart was just over the 60. He was probably tempted to go the double-double. But like me, it looked to be... A good guide. Just took a little bit off of the second dart. Made the adjustment, found the trouble 20, and then found the double eight. 105.31 O'Shea, 107.34, and climbing. 180. 180, number two. 100. 's on for O'Shea look at this 140 well, 12 dart in leg two for Thornton which was a break of throw backed up with a break of throw from 49. O'Shea in 12 he's on an 11 here John, trouble 20 for tops Oof. Does have the most wonderful action accent, does John O'Shea. 28. Fifty-eight. John, you require seventy-two. The Cork accent, they tend to almost sing. Game shot on the fourth leg. That is John O'Shea. 15 dart hold of throw from John O'Shea. His first hold of throw in the match. Levels things up at two apiece, Fifth and we are Robert on throw. First. Game on. 41. 140. 140. Yeah, very much. Uh, 134. The John Candy planes, trains, and automobiles for John O'Shea getting here yesterday. 96. He did eventually land safe and sound, and he's playing soundly here. Both players still way over the 100, 100 average. Nearly 102 for Thornton. Nearly 106 for O'Shea. Special match so far. 65. Shouldn't have been anywhere near the trouble 20 on 265. 519s leave 170. So you get three darts at the same target area. He's got away with it. Not sure what Thornton's doing there. 100. Is he conducting an orchestra or giving himself a slap? 
30. And this is just John, down to the relentless pressure from O'Shea. Now he may go tops, tops. Although I don't mind him not 60. with Thornton on 141. Robert, you require 141. Not looked in the form in this leg to take this out, and he won't. 55. John, you require 40. So, to go in front for the first time in the match. Game shot on the fifth leg. And that is John O'Shea. a 16 dart breaker throw. We'll have the darts now in leg six to pick up his first two points of the day and, well, without doubt, performance of the day John so far. Throw first. Game on. Two one eighties. Ninety seven. Hundred percent on his doubles. An average of hundred and two. Very, very tidy. This isn't bad. Hundred and eighty. Four now in the match, two apiece. One hundred and forty. Well, this is the performance I expected in match one from O'Shea. 100. He's producing the goods here. Thornton keeping him honest, though. 43 up. John had the darts here. 84. Oof. Well, it's not really enough. Only 41 adrift. Here's Thornton. Another one of those. 140. Certainly make things interesting. Our last match. Went to the wire, and it's looking. 60. This one is going to do Robert, the same. You require 81. Double 13. 55. Mm. John, you require 120. Well, 120 to finish off a blinder. Trouble 20 for tops. Oh. 100. Just over pitched Robert, you on the second 26. dart. Unlucky for Game some. Shot on the Unlucky player. for Robert. Robert a Thornton. 13 dart breaker throw on double 13 for Thornton. And he does level things up. And he will have the darts in the seventh and deciding leg. Seventh and final leg. It's Robert to throw first. Game on. What a game of darts this has been. 100. Winning legs for Thornton, 17, 12, and 13 darts. 95. O'Shea, 12, 15, and 16. Oh, Thornton's average just dipped below a ton for the first time, down to 97.59. O'Shea's still over the ton. 55. Mm, won't be now. Sixty. A minimum of a one forty is required, or should I say, a minimum of two big trebles in the visit? So still a bit of breathing space for Thornton. Looks a little tight. Recovers well. One hundred and twenty-five. Well, after that first start, my goodness, feared the worst. Back comes O'Shea again. Wow. Robert, Tenacious you stuff from the Irishman. Double eight. Double four. 72. Wow. Two match starts for Robert Thornton. John, that 180 74. piled the pressure on. 20 for tops. There's the 20. 34. Robert, you require four. Come on. Game, shot. Robert Thornton and the match. Robert makes Thornton. it two from two. A 4-1 win over Burness. It's followed up with a 4-3 win over O'Shea. And look at the averages there. 95-97 for Thornton. 99.39 in defeat. 
for O'Shea, but a really, really enjoyable game. Right, up next, Sean McDonald against Kevin Burness. Follow that one. What a match that was from Robert Thornton and John O'Shea. I'll give you a quick table update. Uh, Keelan K on four points plus three. Robert Thornton, four points plus two. Richard Burnett, two points plus one. And Sean McDonald and Kevin Burness. Kevin Burness minus three after losing 4 1. And Sean McDonald's. Sean McDonald, no points, minus two. I like Burnett in the, Burness in this one. You can get him an eight to 11. I think he wins big. He usually responds well after defeat. And he was on the end of a defeat. A big one in his opening match. 4-1 to Robert Thornton. Remember, this man has had an average of 117.2. He's won back-to-back -back weekly titles. Sure, he's carrying an injury. I've not been informed of anything like that because obviously I would pass that information on. But super game in our last match. Best one of the day so far. First leg, it's Sean to throw first. Game on. This ra wraps up our second cycle, meaning. Everybody will have played twice. Ninety seven. One hundred and forty. Sure, the tempo will particularly suit Burness. However, as I said, I think the eight to eleven. One hundred and forty. It's a bit of a steal. I'd certainly have him much, much shorter against McDonald. Sixty. Enjoying the forty. Attire of McDonald. Looking more like he's out for a afternoon in a posh wine bar. Eighty-one. 
105. Not sure about the size of the sponsor patches. The rule on TV. Rule on TV if you're unaware. 100. Patch size. Kevin, you can require 76. Six square inches. So that's where they usually sized six by one or three Game by two. On the first leg. Kevin Burness. And Kevin Burness gets rid of the 76 to break throw and make the perfect start. That 8 to 11 is looking even more Second leg. It's Kevin attractive first. after leg Game one. On. But I'm pretty sure those six square inch rules are fairly irrelevant. Uh, for our online darts live league. So I don't know why they're not wearing bigger ones. 96. I know most of these players, of course, have competed on TV, so they're all... 100. All pre-done on their shirts, but if I was McDonald and I've picked up a couple of sponsors of this, I'd insist on them making some nice big ones. I want to see them. I want to know what they are. And if I can't see them, neither can you. 100. Ninety-eight. One hundred and thirty five. One hundred and five. Sean, you require one hundred and seventy. Keelan K and Robert Thornton to follow this one. Kevin, you require 140. I do hope you followed me in first thing this morning when I well, made you all aware. They priced Thornton up at 6 to 1. Sean, you require 117. Now, that's to win this Group A. Not win the whole thing, just to win Group A. 100. Even if he doesn't, that price is too big. Those 57. of you that understand Kevin, you require 40. gambling will know that's what it's all about. It's finding the value. Can Burness find the double turn? Looks awkward, doesn't it? 20. Sean, you require 60. With the way his dart sit, that was not a guide. If he was left-handed, it would have been perfect. Forty. Kevin, you require twenty. Game shot on the second no leg. No mistake Kevin from Burness. Burness. And he backs up with the breaker throw in leg one with a holder throw in leg two. Looking very, very comfortable, isn't he? It's McDonald to throw first Third in leg, leg three. Sean to throw first. Game on. One hundred and forty. Eighty five. One hundred and forty. Ninety-five. 
60. Of course, we had some actual dark tournaments um, over the weekend. 76. MAD Jordan and the. 161. We're hosting the Gibraltar Opens. Place I used to live for a couple of years. Lovely spot, Gibraltar. 60. Jamie Nunes won the Open of Gibraltar, and the Gibraltar Open winners were Gavin Smith, Laura Turner, and the ladies. 140. Caden Jordan Smith winning the youths. A well supported event, I think, considering travel restrictions. Double 16 for 2 1. 85. Kevin, you require 105. Oh, that's the danger. 65. Check 75. Sean, you require 16. Game shot on the third leg. And Sean McDonald. The miscount irrelevant from Burness. Um, and it's just a hold a throw for McDonald. So Burness still has that all important break of throw. Eight. He it's leads 2 1. First. Has the darts to make it 3 1. 140. of course multiple event multiple events over the three or four days that the players are in Gibraltar. It's just good to see some ranking events back. The super series of course. In the PDC Super Series, should I say. Kicks off Checking the the time, but it does 96. kick off today. Super Series 4, Players' Championships 13, 14, 15, and 16. There's two blocks of these, and we'll eventually then find out 60. our lineup for the World Match Play, which is in the middle of July. Myself and Paul Nicholson will be there for you for... Talk sport, bringing you all the action 71. so you can listen in on your travels. Kevin, you require 161. Of course, the return of Gezi Price. It's been a while. 99. Interesting to see the form of Gedwin Price. I think it kicks off around about 1 or 2 o'clock. 89. Kevin, you require 62. 62. Tops, 3-1. 22. Sean, you require 145. A lovely day for a darts fan. Just as we're winding up the final group match here, you'll be able to watch all the action on pdc.tv. Only a couple 65. of quid a month, I think, to watch Kevin, the you action. Kevin, require 40. Of course, they do put some free matches on YouTube and Facebook from time to time. Game shot on the fourth leg. And Kevin, Kevin Burness with an 18-dart hold of his own. Moves 3-1 up and in complete control, 8-11. to 11. <laughs> How big was that? Fifth leg, it's Sean to throw first. Game on. Fortunately, I've given you five consecutive winners, so that's my lot for the day. I'm only allowed to give you five. As long as I get told off. I did have 93. One that didn't uh, deliver. So five out of six ain't bad, as the song Ninety-six. 
was sung by Abbott. 85. Good to see the PDC back with the top 128 Forty players five. in the world, the tour card holders. Again, a few places have been filled by first reserves. 96. Well, we'll have a rundown of the draw, actually, when it comes out and give you a... If there's anything that stands out. Matt Porter recently, of course, in an interview. He's confident... One hundred and forty. Things will slowly return to normal, especially with the European tour. Those wonderful weekends. Ninety-nine. Sean, you require one hundred and twenty. Yes, the final two blocks of players' championship events are going to take place from today until the seventeenth. And then Bolton, July the 6th to the 82. 9th. So the players are only going to get Kevin, you about a week's notice before the match play starts. How exciting will that final day of play be? Someone's going to come out of the pack and qualify 88. for the world match play. Sean, you require My favourite tournament. So top for Vanessa to wrap require it up. Forty four one game shot and, and the match. Four Kevin one Burness. it is with a sixteen dart breaker throw. Tops in one dart and enjoy a couple of points of free money from Mason. An average of eighty nine forty forty six for Benes. That's decent enough. That's for sure. Okay, up next, Keenan Kay against Robert Thornton. Still is just about the morning, 18 minutes past 11, and it's Robert Thornton who currently is in 
second position on oh no it's my bad he's top of course leg difference plus four to keelan k's plus three so winner of this one will most definitely top the table alone only leg difference separating them at the moment first leg well, it's keelan to throw first i'm not allowed to give Game you any more but Robert Thornton's four to seven to beat Keelan K. Well, I've just sixty. All I can say is I'm flabbergasted. Make of that what you will. Can't be classed as a as a tip then, can it? Forty-five. One hundred and forty. Well, as to be said, he's playing very, very well today. One hundred and forty. Keelan K. I expected this from Thornton. It has to be said. One hundred. Not so much. From Keelan so far. 180. This is as consistent as I've seen him play. He has put matches together. 78. Not quite Robert, this level. Robert, you require 136. 96. Keelan, you require 123. Eighty-two. Robert, you require forty. Game shot on the first and leg. One nil in the blink of an eye, and Thornton has a break of throw. Again, four to seven. Mind-blowingly big for Thornton. Second he leads leg. one nil. Robert to throw first. Game on. Despite starting. 100. With 45. That was 456 in 10 darts for Robert Thornton. 140. 140, 180, 96 out in one. 60. And of course, a break of throw. 85. I'm sure you can understand my, my logic. Even if he doesn't win the group, from what we've seen so far, we now have seen all the players play twice. Six to one to top this field is too 79. big about Robert Thornton. Fifty five. Forty nine. Thornton's just got to avoid playing Keelan K here. He's just got to play the board because it's easy to get wrapped up in. Keelan, you require and the way Keelan plays, because he, he goes through spells where he doesn't look like he's going to do anything, and then all of a sudden, from absolutely nowhere, swarms you. 100. Robert, you require 118. Trouble 20, double 19. Trouble 18. 58. Hit either. Keelan, you require 48. So, Keelan, to break back. Thirty-eight. Well, that's the first real Robert, clutch you double. Sixty. He's failed to hit. Well, that caught the flight. Fifty. Keelan, you require ten. Game shot on the second leg. Keelan K. That's a 19-dart break of throw 
The impressive breaker throw coming from Thornton in 13. And then a poor leg and Keelan Third leg. creeps it's up Keelan to throw and first. takes Game the on. leg in 19 darts. And that's the kind of play that Thornton 28. has got to try and avoid getting involved in. Though did have two darts for the hold of throw and 2-0 lead. 60. One hundred and eighty. Three in his one hundred opening match. Keenan K in that four two win over O'Shea. Ninety six. In the four three win over Burnett, only it the one. Oh dear. Eighty. That one nearly came out. Sixty needs to fill it here, Thornton. Forty one. Keelan, you require one hundred and thirty seven. Eighty eight. Sixty-one. And no finish. Can't do one five Keelan nine. Require forty-nine. So forty-nine for two-one, an unlikely-looking two-one lead. That's for sure. Thirty-nine. As I said, no finish. One five nine. Fifty-nine. Keelan, you require 10. 10. Game shot on the third leg. Keelan K. It's a 20 dart holder throw. So two winning legs for Keelan K have been won in 19 and 20 darts. And he finds himself 2 1 up. Robert Thornton at the moment is averaging Fourth 80. Leg. It's Robert to throw first. Game on. Twenty six. Where has this come from? How lucky are or is a bookmaker? One hundred. Absolutely priced this up totally wrong. And Thornton is playing like a bag of nails at the moment. One hundred and forty. Well, that's better. is only his second 140 84. of the contest. And we're into the fourth leg. I'm sure he's throwing too quick. 45. He's in trouble here. Okay, only 27 behind. And this was the leg. 58. So Thornton started. A breaker throw here would be a disaster. Where has that gone? Twenty eight. Ninety six. Fifty-six. So we might have handed Keelan some lucky Heather on the way in. My goodness, what is going on with Thornton's 59. game? He's averaging seventy-six. One hundred. 
Keelan, you require 104. Average 96 last time out. He's 20 points off that. 84. Robert, you require 106. Tops. 66. Keelan, you require 20. Game shot on the fourth leg. Keelan K. Mark Thornton did have a dart. At tops there for 2-2. Two, two. He finds himself 3-1 down and a, a double break of throwdown. Fifth leg. It's Keelan to throw first. Game on. That was a 21 dart break of throw this time. So Thornton started with 13. And then K has won in legs of 19, 20 and 21. 100. One hundred. I did quit gambling on darts many, many years ago. And you probably can see why. <laughs> Twenty-eight. How on earth is this happening? Now, Keelan K would 140. have won in 13, 14, and 14 and found himself 3 1 up. I could just say, well, hmm, hands up. That 68. happens, that starts. But Keelan, you require 121. Thornton here averaging 75.27. Well, he's not going to go for the win. No, he's not going to go for 81. the win. 81. Good ball management from Keelan K. And left tops after 12. Let's win it with the 50. best leg of Keelan the match for Keelan K here. It started with a 13. Game shot. And it's and finished with a 13. Keelan K. And Keelan K makes it three out of three. And he's been the underdog, big underdog, in all three matches. But that match was all about how bad Robert Thornton was. Well, if you had him in your accumulator... Or, like me, if you looked at that and thought, wow, that price is too big, unlucky. Right, up next, it's Kevin Burness against Richie Burnett. Me notes just for a change, right? Richie Burnett against Kevin Burness. This one has all the ingredients to be an absolute thriller. Don't be surprised to see this one go all the way. I'm sure we'll have a quick update on the table. And there you go, Keenan K is at the top. I certainly expected it to be Robert Thornton. That played three, one, three. Lost none. Leg difference First plus leg. six. It's to throw rightly first. tops the table. Game on. Three out of three for the young man from Liscard. And the rest of the pack are trying to chase him down. Starting 
with these two. 45. Richie Burnett won his opening game 4-2 against Sean McDonald. Kevin Burnett went down 4-1 to a very impressive Robert Thornton. Then Richie Burnett lost 4-3, had match darts against Keelan Kay. And then Kevin Burnett played the darts. We know he's capable of winning 4-1 against Sean McDonald. That was that one that was... Stood out to me this morning, the 8 to 11. 140. And he obliged, although I was saying that. I thought Thornton would oblige there at 4 to 7, but I'm pretty sure even he, well, he certainly wouldn't have expected to average 41. just 74.12. 100. Price this one up. Even money, Richie Burnett. 8 to 11, Burness. Hmm. 60. I suppose that's just about right. Into our... 44. Third phase of this group. player plays five games over the Kevin, you course of the morning and early afternoon. One hundred and forty five. Whoever comes out. Richie you require one hundred and fifty five. Uh, not just this group, but actually gets the final three places for next week's Champions Week. We'll have Seriously, they're in their place. Kevin, you require 25. I need these six players in Group A. Game shot on the first leg. Kevin, Kevin Burness Burness. does break through in 18 darts. Richie was waiting on 58 and had to watch that last dart go in Second as leg. always. Kevin to throw first. Game on. Yeah, not just the, the six in this group. On Thursday morning, playing against those that finish 4-5-6 in this group will be Corinne Hammond, Reese Robinson and Aaron Monk. 60. The top two from that group will then go into Saturday night's final. And then on Thursday 96. and Friday evening with... Players who finish second and third in this Group A will be Mark Webster, James Richardson, and Rob Collins. My goodness. 100. Fifty-seven. I did think Burnett would struggle with Burness. I'll tell you why in a moment. If I can find... 140. My bit of paper amongst my many thousand bits of paper. Where is it? 140. Sixty. Kevin, you require 68. 64. Richie, you require 141. 49. So this Kevin, is you require the four. seventh meeting between these two in the online darts live league. Game shot on the second leg. As Kevin Burness. Kevin Burness doubles his lead. It's like a paper mill in here. Yeah, Kevin Burness doubles his lead, Third leads 2-0. Yeah, so this is the seventh meeting. 
Richie Burnett won their first meeting, 4-3, with a 97.64 average. Kevin Burness, 104.94. Then Kevin Burness won their next meeting, 4-2, before Burnett winning the next meeting, 4-3. And then Burness won the next three, 4-2, 4-1, 4-1. As an art player, I'm going to assure you, you know your record against your opponents. Fifty nine. One hundred and forty. Ninety-six. Richie you require one hundred and sixty-one. A must-win leg for Richie. Uh, stating the obvious in a race to four. Forty-one. Sixty. Richie you require one hundred and twenty. One hundred. Eighty. Richie, you require twenty. Game shot on the third and leg. Richie, Richie Burnett, Burnett does hold throw and picks up his first leg of the match, but Kevin Burness still in control with that. Break of throw leads 2 1, has Fourth the darts in leg to four. Throw first. Game on. We, of course, after Champions Week next week, which is week five, week six, we go again. And week 10, of course, will be Champions Week all over again. And again, with increased prize money 45. over 12,000 pounds. And by the completion of that, we would have. Used over a hundred players in the online darts live league, and of course, as restrictions open and one hundred things get back to some sort of normality, we'll of course be using players from well all over the world where possible. Fifty-five people sometimes have asked about oh, how come players have played back-to-back -back weeks? Well. What usually happens, if we have a player come from either Scotland or Ireland, they will tend to play in the Thursday and Friday groups and then stay on for the following week. For to obviously make it worth travelling under these current climates. Worth it. 100. We're not going to get Robert Kevin Thornton to drive nine hours down the motorway to play... Thursday and Friday morning, are we? A few of you have struggled with that concept. <coughs> 100. Kevin, you require 25. For 3 1. That would be the. Game shot on the fourth Best leg play. of Kevin the match Burness. for Kevin Burness, a 14 darter, another hold of throw, and a 3 1 lead. Burnett looking in trouble in this one, like Thornton was Fifth in the last one. Richie's a throw first. Game on. Richie only averaging 81 in this one. 100. One hundred. Next match will be match number nine, and it will be John O'Shea against Sean McDonald. 
62. Another one. I think they've got a little wrong. They've got John O'Shea, 8 to 11. Sean McDonald, who's having a bit of a mare today. Even 60. money. I think O'Shea will be all over that one. I'd certainly be one hundred and taking them on if I did have a punt at 8 to 11. I am 100. relaying. I was writing down this morning, so I presume they've not changed too much. I will double check for you. Well, no, John O'Shea is a 60. He's into eight, eight to 13 for obvious reasons. I still think that's tempting. Sean McDonald so far today has not shown 60. us anything. Richie requires 139. He wins that game. But this is for a break of throw for Burnett. If he doesn't get it, leave it handy, Richie. Burnett is back on 181. 83. That sometimes it's just a lapse in concentration. I tend to take it for granted that... You're just going to hit the 19 56. and you, you take your eye off the target. There we go. Double 18. His Game favourite double. Fifth leg. Richie, Burnett. Richie Burnett does hold throw. Needs a break of throw, of course. I thought that was a break of throw momentarily, but it wasn't. It was a hold of throw. So Sixth the biggest leg, leg of the match coming up first. right now. Game on. Ninety-nine. Just the one break of throw, the opening leg for Kevin Burness. Is this the fight back from Burnett? One hundred. He can scrap. Can store key. Actually, he did a bit of amateur boxing back in the day. Did Richie when he was a youth? One hundred and eighty. Great reply. Trading right hands if this was a fight with those maxes. 121. 100. It's like an octopus, isn't he, when he throws that third dart? <laughs> but it all happens once the... Dart is released, very much like jockey. 140. His body almost Kevin acts like a shock absorber for tension. Trouble 18 leaves the ball. He's going to get a match dart at the ball. 78. All right, Richie. Richie Last requires knock -ins 60. Here. 20 and tops for 3-3 three, three and the break back. Richie will have the darts in the decider. Game shot on the sixth In leg. it goes. Richie Burnett. Wonderful leg of darts there from Richie Burnett. I think that was an 11 darter to level things up. It's the break of throw. Richie will start seventh, the seventh and final, and leg. final it's leg. Richie to throw first. Game on. It was an 11 darter. Best of the day. What a time to find it. And then kicks off. We're the 140. Richie Burnett now the one to four favourite in running. 43. He was a big dog at 2 0 down. 92. Super last start. Really was a recovery. 100. So still a healthy cushion for Richie. Just takes the pressure off. 100. Still is a wonderful player, but trust me, 
in the mid 90s he was absolutely exceptional during 60. a period where I was travelling everywhere and trying to make my way in the sport we became pals travelled a bit played a few doubles events and played against each other a lot and 60. he was when he was on it absolutely outstanding maybe he didn't re reproduce the quality but he threw Richie in the big knockouts and opens and ranking tournaments but I've seen him throw darts which match up to anything I've ever seen 57 even on the little old boards He's looking good here for picking up 105 Richie, you require 52. Second win of the day. Topsy needs. 32. Oh, dear Richie. Well, this would be Kevin, an absolute sickness. Kevin, you require sickness. 110. Dear. Is Richie... Going to pay the price. Two match darts. Oh, my goodness. Not Richie's like, oh, my God. Thirty-five remaining. Seventy-eight. Richie, you require twenty. Double ten. To move on to four points. Game shot. Double and ten. Match. He gets. Richie Burnett. And Richie Burnett does pick up his second win of the day. Are we going to get a look at the numbers? There you go. Very little between them in the end. No wonder it went all the way. Richie Burnett, in fairness, four out of six on the double, 66.66%. Very, very impressive indeed. That was the highlight of the match. Okay, we're going to return with John O'Shea against Sean McDonald. Good win in the end there for Richie Burnett and stops the run of three consecutive defeats to Kevin Burness. Well, talking about three consecutive defeats, Sean McDonald is facing three defeats on day one in this Group A Week 4 phase of the Online Darts Live League. There's a table update. Keenan K still out on top. Richie Burnett. Moving in to second spot on four points with Robert Thornton on four points. Burness on two. Incredibly, O'Shea and McDonald yet to pick up a win. Well, someone's O's going to go. And I don't think it's going to be McDonald's. First I think leg. O'Shea Johnson wins this first. one and Game wins on. it handy. One hundred and forty.
Eighty-five. One hundred and forty. Back to back. One forties for John. As I said, the current. One more world master. Although I don't think it was Six called two. the the Winmore World Masters, um, BDO managed to destroy the longest running 100. sponsorship deal in World Darts. Just when you didn't think it could get any worse, but I am under the impression that Winmore are back on board to support it. Now it's being run by the actual official official governing body of. That side of darts, 96. the World Darts Federation. John, you require 121. Well, of course, the BDO are just affiliated to. So, double 18 for a 12 darter. 103. Might have been the perfect start for O'Shea. Yeah, as I said, that's to be returning. I do believe it will be on your TV screens in December, the World Masters. 60. John, you require 18. The people who look after the Dutch Open will be Game running that event, the so there'll be John O'Shea. certainly no uh, fake names in the draw or redraws or whatever else of a calamity took place in 2019. They certainly first. know how to run a big event in the Netherlands. I'm certainly hoping to be there. But more info on that over the next weeks and months. 60. That is great to see side of our sport returning it's a great outlet for players 100. that are learning their trade or simply don't fancy playing in the PDC or many other opportunities out there many players over the years were quite happy where they are remember Glenn Durrant BDO for life well, eventually, he did 140. make that transition. My goodness, with some success, of course, winning the Premier League last year. 83. Silenced the doubters and those that what they know about darts, you can put on the back of a postage stamp, and not a very big one. Anybody who doubted Durrant's credentials were, like I said, 138. Either casual dart fans or those without any knowledge, or of course those that had an agenda. You get the same thing about Six Martin eight. Adams. Like I said, I choose to listen Jordan to my peers 80. about sport, especially darts. Tops for one apiece. 60. So it's been a good start to this game. It was a 13 dart hold from O'Shea. And McDonald there has just missed tops for a 15. 100. Sean, you require 20. Game shot on the second leg. Sean McDonald. And a 16 dart hold there for Sean McDonald to level things up at one apiece. All going with the throw. O'Shea averaging 96 right now. First. Game on. McDonald some 10 points behind.
85. Sixty. <coughs> Eighty five. One hundred and eighty. First max of the match goes the way of the Irishman. Sixty. John, you require one hundred and thirty. This is the final match of the third cycle of this. Opening day of Group A. 105. Oh, he went for it. Fair play. I don't blame him. McDonald back on 271. Needs two trebles to leave a finish. Each player will have two more matches to play. 31. At the completion of this match. John, you require 25. One hundred. John, you require ten. Well, he's making a bit of graft out of it, isn't he? One for double two. There's the one. Game shot and on the there's third the double leg. two. John O'Shea. Even after all of that, it was only an 18 dart hole to throw for O'Shea. It shows you how good of a scoring leg that was. And he does Four lead legs. throw. Sean's all three legs, first. three holds a throw. Game on. Forty one. Of questions asking why 177 you know the likes of Steve Beaton or Michael Van Gerwen or Garwin Price or Glenn Durant can't play in this well the tour card holders there's 128 of them are unfortunately more fortunately, whichever way you look at it, contracted to only play in PDC-sanctioned events. And although we fall under the guise of the DRA, so in terms of players' behaviour, etc., um, those 128 tour card, tour card holders can't compete. If it wasn't streamed... Which then would be fairly pointless or shown on TV Thursday, Friday and Saturday nights, then they would be allowed to play. But the PDC protecting their brand, which is totally understandable. But we still live in hope that they may allow us to use, I don't know, players ranked 65 and above. That would uh, benefit everybody, benefit our brand, and of course, benefit those players who were who were on the fringes. One hundred and twenty-three. Some serious money, and that Surely prize money is going up. Ten thousand in prize money next week, and week ten, which will be Champions Week two, there'll be twelve thousand. Well, the powers that be. 97. Ultimately, want to make this £10,000 the winner. It's already the highest prize in amateur darts. Game shot on the fourth leg. And John, John O'Shea, O'Shea does eventually get a break of throw and now leads 3 1.
and has the darts to make it 4 1. As I said, I thought the prize was it's John to throw first. more than attractive. Game on. Although I did think that about Robert, Robert Thornton, but I certainly didn't expect chocolate to perform like candy. 140. So Shea's second 13 darter of the match. Leg number four. That was that break of throw. 96. Averaging 100 at the minute. Big John O'Shea. One hundred and forty. No relation to Tony, of course. Although both absolute gentlemen. Ninety seven. They certainly have that in common as well as their last name. Back to back one forties for John O'Shea. Started leg one like this and finished with a thirteen darter. Sixty. Is he gonna do the same here? Thornton versus Burnett. Tie of the day for me. Fifty-eight. John, you require one hundred and sixty-one. And then it'll be Sean McDonald up against Keelan Kay. And they've got Sean McDonald. Ninety-nine. Eight to thirteen favourite. Keelan Kay six to five. Keelan Kay unbeaten for the day so far. Sean McDonald yet to get a win. Work that one out. Sixty. John, you require sixty-two. Tops for the match. Game shots and, and a the match. Very, John O'Shea. very tidy performance there from O'Shea. Winning legs of 13, 18, 13, and 15. And he picks up his first two points of the day. There's the numbers for you. 97.58, the average for O'Shea. Lost with a 99 earlier, of course, didn't he? Lovely on the finishing. Four out of nine, 44%. And a high of 62. But a great performance again. Robert Thornton against Richie Burnett. That'll be right up.
Good afternoon. It is afternoon, 10 past 12. And welcome back to the Online Darts Live League, week four of phase two. Don't forget Champions Week coming up next week. There's a table update. So the winner of this one goes in to second spot. Unless, of course, Richie wins 4 0. First leg, it's Robert to throw first. On count back, Game of course. On. Burnett lost to Keelan K. They've met 19 times in official competition over the years. 100. And Robert Thornton holds a 13 6 lead. Eighty-five. He had one meeting in a ranked major. One hundred. And that was the Players' Championship Finals back in two thousand and thirteen. on that one. 6-4. 40. Oh well, there's a lot of water under the bridge since then and now in terms of where their careers were then and where they are now. 60. Both still ambitious. Neither has anything to prove, of course, in the world of darts. Multiple major winners on both sides 57. for Robert Thornton, of course. Richie Burnett made a few finals. Ninety four. Had his troubles as Richie over the years. Great to see him happy, healthy, and throwing some great stuff. 40. <laughs> 140. Robert, you require 164. One hundred and twenty eight. Richie requires sixty two. Double sixteen. Game shot on the first Pins leg. It. Richie and Burnett. It's a break of throw for Burnett. Five to six each of two for a reason. I couldn't pick a winner. I couldn't split them. Anything, I was just siding towards Second, though, Thornton prior to that performance a couple of matches ago. But it really is a pick em game. 41. 100. These two, of course, are involved in a an absolute thriller, which I'm just trying to find my stats for. 60. Well, they've been involved in multiple matches, of course. 180. In the live league. 60. So, Thornton, turning a 180, looking to break back. 60. Yeah, Richie had a match. His best performance, actually, of the live league, only using 109 darts. 100. Robert, you require 161. One 
100. Yeah, there was only 109 darts used in the entire match. And that was against Robert Thornton. And I want about 109 darts from both. 100. On that case, Robert, you require Robert Thornton 61. averaged 99.06 and Richie Burnett averaged 109.31. 53. 140 for 2 Richie, 0 you for Burnett. 140. At their first meeting back in March. Two tens for a 140. 130. And that was a 4 2 win for Robert, Thornton. Then Burnett 1 4 2. Thornton 1 4 2. Burnett 1 4 1. Burnett 1 4 2. Then Burnett 1 4 3. Then he 1 4 1. Game shot on the second leg. So he had a streak of four wins in the live league against Robert Thornton before Robert responded and then picked up a couple of wins of his own. But that's a break back. It's and it's one first. apiece. A dart Game on. at double 10 off the 140 for Burnett. Well, unfortunately, he flushed at it a little bit. 140. Two legs played. Two breaks to throw. Both in 18 darts. Yeah, so we had the run of four for Burnett. And then Thornton won 4 1. Then Burnett won 4 1. And then Thornton won their last match 16. 4 0. Which was on the 28th of May, to be precise. 100. One hundred and forty. Ninety six. Stephen K. Robert, you require one hundred and sixty one. In match number eleven against Sean McDonald. One hundred and thirty seven. Now as I said, the odds on this one, they have Sean McDonald 8 to 13, Keelan K 6 to 5. 100. Don't fill your boots. Robert, you require 24. They've met three times prior. Keelan K winning on two occasions 4 0, the and then losing 4 3. And of course, Keelan K today undefeated 3 from 3. Sean McDonald yet to pick up a win. Just trying to mark Fourth your cards. Leg. It's Richie to throw first. Game on. Best leg of the match there. A hold of throw for Robert Thornton. The first hold of this contest. That's awkward for Burnett. Oh, he risks it. What a beautiful adjustment. 100. 180. The thorn starting to turn the screw. Richie just getting frustrated. He's finding that that mark that's no good to him underneath the 60. And he doesn't like to switch, does Richie? As you can see, eventually 61. he has to. One hundred. One hundred and forty. Robert, you require one hundred and thirty-seven. Could go tops, tops. Does go tops, tops. Oof. Ninety-seven. Richie, you require one hundred and forty. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, the football as well as the darts. Kick off at two o'clock. Good luck to Scotland. Robert, you require and Glasgow playing game shot on the fourth leg. Czech Republic. Robert Thornton. And Robert Thornton does get the break of throw, a 13 darter. He really has gone through the gears here. 18, 14, Big and leg. 13. His last three game winning on. legs. I hope it's not as hot as it is down in the south Four of England. Five. It's an absolute scorcher again. Touched 30 down here yesterday. That's no good for football, especially if you're Scottish. My goodness. One hundred and twenty three. One hundred. Fortunately, it is very, very mild. And not raining. Perfect weather for the players. Up there in Glasgow today. Forty four. Fifty nine. Made a mistake there, Richie. Probably should have had his first start down at the 19s, especially the way he's been blocking with that dart at the 20. 85. No real damage done. Burnett still has two visits to get rid of this 200. Yeah, it's just a little bit too much use of the tricep. 85. Trying so hard, you can see it in his body. Both players have one more match to play after this one. 44. Thornton will be up against McDonald. Richie, you require 150. Burnett will be up against O'Shea in our penultimate match. Ninety nine. Oh, he's left double eight. Robert, this you is a real showbiz shot. Ball, ball double 16. If he misses the ball and it's a 25, cancel that. 48. So if he'd have hit a 25 at least, it would have left 107, which Richie is trouble 19 and ball. But double eight for a break of throw and to close the gap. Game shot on the fifth uh, leg. Richie, Richie Burnett. Does break throw in 20 darts. Thornton will be disappointed with that one. That was a real poor leg through 21 darts, and not one of them was at a double. Sixth leg. It's so Richie, Richie closes first. the gap to one. Game on. Has the darts in leg six. Can he take us all the way yet again? A dart right underneath the trouble 20 wire. Fifty nine. One hundred and twenty three. Same placement every time. It's just the tiniest of adjustments 93 it's a great recovery from Burnett 
No, the door is most definitely ajar here for Thornton. 140. Talking about ajar, he's booting it down. One hundred. Needs another, finds another. Will he stay there? Wow, what a time to find Robert, your you first 180 of the match. When you really, really need to. 90. So, treble 14. Richie requires 74. We'll leave double 16. 14, we'll leave 20 in tops. So, one dart should be getting one dart at tops. That's only just off the 42. To leave 32, 60 left. 30. There's the 20. Has to move. Has to change his line. 34. Oh dear, Richie. Yeah. What am I Robert, about? you require 48. 8 well, wasn't and the quite Robert the classic we all hoped for and uh, nearly went all the way one dart tops for Richie there to take us to a seventh and deciding leg but it is Robert Thornton who prevails an average very respectable again 85 ish and 87 nothing wrong with that at all if you can do better make sure you enter the qualifiers and come and show us how good you are if not be quiet up next, Sean McDonald against Keelan Kay.
early prices were... 140. As I said... Keelan K, 11 to 100. 10. Sean McDonald, 4 to 6. Well, they met three times. Two of those occasions, Keelan K won 4-0 and 4-0. And the other one was a 4-3 win to McDonald in a real low-quality affair. And they're now 5 to 6 59. each of two, which still represents value when you consider one hasn't lost a game today and the other hasn't won one. So make of that what you will. Just pointing 59. you in the right direction. Oh, I'd like to think I am. Uh, we will have a look at the table uh, shortly. I've got it here somewhere. But we will put it up on screen. Uh, what I can tell you 58. Is Thornton has joined Keelan K on six points. Both. Players on six points. 139. But the big difference is Keelan K plus six. Robert Thornton only plus one. But like I said, Thornton six to one this morning. I tipped him up before the off. Told you to well, not get your house on it, but maybe have a, a pound or two at six to one to win this group A. Way, way too big. And I think we've already seen at times why. Yes, he did have that one. Well, really bizarre, um, poor performance. 43. Uh, Sean earlier. McGuire, 104. And that was against Keelan K, of course, wasn't it? <laughs> the average 75 or something. It'll be 32 left. 54 left 50. 18 leaves 32. 72. And 160 for Keenan Keenan K. Keenan, you require 160. 160. Tops. Game shot on the first oh, leg. Absolutely K. incredible from absolutely nowhere. Our table topper takes out the highest finish of the day so far. A beautiful 160. It was the middle of everything, wasn't it? Second leg, standing it's stuff. To throw first. And Game on. more good news, it was a break of throw. 100. I'm hearing the rumours that we're not going to be coming out of lockdown in a week's time. I hope that's not the case. And the sources are more 60. to do with catch up. Ninety three. If it still gets moved 100. a month, of course, the world match play will still be going ahead with a capacity crowd. 58 100 The pace won't suit Keelan, however, that's not affected their three previous meetings. Their aggregate score over those three meetings is 12 3 in favour of Keelan K. 96. Yeah. Keelan, you require however, 150. Priced it up, made it. Five to six each of two. And like I say earlier on, they made McDonald favourite. 
118. Beautiful. Sean, you require 140. Beautiful counting from Keelan K. Oh, we had a 160 in leg one. Ooh, see, we're going to get a 145 in leg two. 87. Keelan, you require 32. Game shot on the second leg. And I tell you enough, 17 dart hold a throw consolidates that 160 15 dart break a throw in leg one. And Sean McDonald, not for the first time today, first. has Game it all off. to do. One hundred and forty. Eighty one. Eighty one. Fifty seven. Must win leg, of course, and must hold a throw for McDonald. I think the back swings are a little bit over exaggerated for 44. McDonald. It causes the elbow to lift, which then, of course, has its own implications in terms of 81. Becoming repetitive. You see on the back swing, it comes all the way back, and look, the elbow goes. Up and right. This game is all about consistency. And if there's so many moving parts, it's hard to be consistent, obviously. Well, with Keelan, it's pretty much just up and 60. down, isn't it? Sean, you require 141. So it's easy to, to replicate the successful darts. One hundred and nine. One hundred and eighty. Oh, just in Sean case. Require thirty-two. Don't expect him to miss. Sixteen. Keelan, you require 42. 22. Sean, you require 16. Take advantage there, Keelan K. So Sean McDonald should hold throw now and close the gap to just one. Could have been worse. Game Could have been facing 3-0 down the barrel. But he does find the double eight. And it is 2-1. Keelan K, of course, does have that valuable break of throw. He has the darts Short in leg, leg four. Keelan to throw first. Game on. Ninety-two. One hundred. One 
140. Most hundreds plus checkouts in a day. In this second phase, Aaron Monks had five. Joe Davis has had five. Remember the Joe Davis one. Nathan Gervin had five. Week one, Jared Cole. 140. Week three, Darren Beveridge, another Scotsman with an absolute Rolls Royce of a throw. He had five. 180. 180, number two for Keelan. Our highest daily average in terms of average average. So a player's average divided over the five matches 60. played in a day. Kevin Burness, week Keelan, one, 98.43. That's seriously impressive. 49. Sensibly setting up the tops. Robert Thornton's the highest with 139. Mike Warburton, Wayne Warren and Niall Cullerton Keelan, in week three, a best winning leg percentage. Game shot on the fourth leg. Keelan K. Keenan K starting to take complete control of this one. A very solid hold of throw there. Gives him a 3-1 lead yet again. McDonald having Big it all to do. Sean to throw first. Game on. 13 dart hold there. Winning legs so far in this match for Keelan K. 15, 17, and 13. He's averaging 95. Donald here averaging 91. This is much more like it. Although it's more of a, 57. a winning average, of course. Uh, um, a scoring average. Ninety six, one hundred and forty. Keenan K trying to get it done here and now. 86. Fifty-four. The remaining matches. Kevin Burdess against John O'Shea. 137. Sean McDonald against Robert Thornton. O'Shea against Burnett. And Keelan Kay against Burness will finish things off for the opening matches in Group 100. A. Sean, you require 42. To close the gap to just one again. A possible 14 darter here for McDonald. Game shot on this the is fifth much, leg. much better from Sean him, McDonald. isn't it? That's a 14 dart hold of throw for McDonald. Still got it all to do, of course, as Keelan Kay has the darts here in leg six. Sixth leg. It's to wrap Keelan things to up. First. Game on. Averaging 94.97 now, Sean McDonald. His 44. highest average and best performance of the day by a long, long way. Just to confirm, the darts does start at 2 p.m. on PDC TV. So, 100. Will be pretty much coming to an 
End of our broadcast. Usually wrapped up by about 10 to 2. So just enough time to make yourself 99. a cup of tea or get some out of the fridge and then get stuck in to an afternoon of the PDC Super Series. 96. Michael Van Gruen eventually going to win himself a, a title. Not one in the last 20 tournaments. The return of Gerwin Price. He faces Joe Mernon. 58. MVG up against Jake Jones and Gary Anderson. We'll be taking on Rob Cross. Ian White versus Simon Whitlock. 100. Few of the standout draws. Don't see anything else that stands out? Fifty-seven. Keelan, you require one hundred and sixty-one. Glenn Durrant, of course, back in ash action after his disappointing. Attempt to defend the Premier League title, saw him finish bottom. 60. He's up against Kirk Shepherd. 98. Dirk Van Dyven Boda up against. Scott Keelan Mitchell, that's a contrast in styles, isn't it? Game, shots, and the match, Keelan uh, Kay. A beautiful finish from Keelan Kay to get things wrapped up. Well, that puts him on four out of four. An end average of 91.48, just behind Sean McDonald, but much better from Sean McDonald. 33.33% in the end on doubles, two from six. And of course, one of them all came in one leg with missed doubles. OK, so that does mean Keelan K does advance to eight points on the table and four from four. We're going to be back in just a moment with Burness against O'Shea. And welcome back. Up next is Kevin Burness against John O'Shea. Both been struggling for wins today. We're going to have a look at the table uh, just to see where that last match has put the distance between himself and everybody else. Dean and Kay now plus eight and on to eight points. Robert Thornton on six points, Burnett on four. So a chance for O'Shea or first Burness leg, Kevin to, throw first. to join Game Burnett on. in third spot. Still lots of darts to be played over the next two days, of course. 97. Fifty-nine. 
One hundred. Ninety-one point four eight was the average for Keelan K with the two one eighties. The high of the day of ninety two point one three for McDonald. And of course, that one sixty finish from one hundred. Keelan finished with a one oh one. That did hit that one sixty early in the match. That's the highest finish of the day. Ninety two. Sean McDonald now minus eleven in Legs. It's going to be super tough to see him. One hundred. Turn that around and finish in the top three to avoid coming back Thursday and Friday morning. Keen and K. Ninety-eight. Absolutely. Kevin, you require one hundred and four. This is the final match of. 96. John, you require the fourth cycle of five. Each player has one more game to play. 92. Kevin, you require eight. So three more matches to go at the conclusion of this Eight one. On the first uh, Kevin Burness pops in with a 16 dart hold of throw against John O'Shea. Know each other very well, of course, these two. Second leg, it's John to throw first. Game on. Kevin originally from Wrexham, I do believe. But now well, he's been living in Ireland for quite some time. One hundred. They would have met in sixty. For many county events, I would have thought in Ireland. It's a massive part of darts. In sixty. Ireland. Much like in uh, 55. The hurling, representing your county is absolutely everything. And they take the same attitude on in their darts. 59. Very passionate about sport. In the Emerald Isle. 85. Neither these two hang around, but 60. certainly not as quick as hurling, the fastest sport in the world. Certainly the fastest team sport in the world. On foot. Before anybody gets pedantic and try to make me believe motor racing is a a sport. Thirty two. John, you require 101. 77. He'll be back. Burness on 190. The game that sort of stands out to me this afternoon. Ryan Searle against John, Josh you Payne. you require 24. Johnny Clayton will be up against Sean Fisher. Who we know very well. Game shot on the second leg. And O'Shea, O'Shea does level things up. At one apiece. Everything on throw at the moment after two legs. Two holds a throw. Third leg. It's Kevin to throw first. Game on. Been low key so far this one. I just feel like it's waiting 60. to explode. One hundred and eighty. Is it about to explode now? One 
140. Good reply. Sixty. One hundred and forty. For Chaz Barstow, also in action today. Good luck to Chaz. He's also been involved heavily in the online darts live league. Kevin, you require one hundred and sixty-one. 120. John, you require 136. He's through everything. Everything I'm here in this leg. Should go down for 19s. Four of them with the left tops. 100. Finds the ton Kevin, to leave double 18. 41. 41. Game shot on the third and leg. And finds Kevin the double, double eight with his final dart to hold throw with O'Shea waiting to pants. On double 18, but all three legs have gone with throw. So Fourth it'll be O'Shea to start to leg four. First. Game on. One hundred and eighty. That's his second. One hundred. One hundred and thirty four. One hundred and forty. John, you require one hundred and nine. Last two legs. John is at one eighties. One is one. Fifty four. Uh, sorry, one is lost. One he looked like he was going to win, but Burness may have other ideas here. Wants the bullseye. Ninety six. John, you require fifty five. Thirty-five. By the way, Charles Barstow will be facing. Kevin, you require twenty-five. Carol Sedlacek. Double eight again. Last start. Ooh. Seventeen. Not this time. John, you require twenty. Not playing for two, just for two points here. It's bragging rights in Ireland. This one. Game shot on the fourth leg. John O'Shea. You can see the passion involved from O'Shea. 16 dart hold of throw, four legs played, four holds of throw, two apiece. Fifth we go leg, on. It's Kevin to throw first. Game on. Are we going to get a break of throw? 60. 134. 41 137 180 First in the match for Burness and didn't he need it it still might not be enough. 180. <laughs> That's a 180 in each of the last three legs now for O'Shea. 40. John, you require 50. Tops for 3-2 in the first break of throw. 
no pressure because no finish. On the fifth leg. And that John is O'Shea. a 12 dart break, a throw for O'Shea. What a game this is turning out to be. I said after a couple of legs, not quite caught fire. Well, it has since then. And it's O'Shea in Sixth control leg. and has John the darts in leg first. six. Game on. Can he close it out? This is obviously his first. 140. Making his debut, should I say, in the live league today. O'Shea was due to 100. compete a few weeks ago, if my memory serves me right, but had issues with the nonsense regulations. 140. So, didn't make it in the end. But rearranged his travel. And he's here meaning business. 140. Eighty-five. A great addition to the live league so far, O'Shea. One hundred. John, you require one hundred and thirty-six. Of course, came out of the pack to win. Win more. Not highly rated in Ireland. One hundred and twenty. I was going to say with darts Kevin, like that, you no wonder. One hundred and sixty-one. One hundred and thirty-six. Wow. O'Shea misses the one thirty-six on double eight. John Ness misses the ball. 16. And a show of respect between the two. Game shot. And, and in the match. steps O'Shea. O'Shea. You can see by the reaction how much that meant to him. Winning the last two legs in just twenty-five darts, twelve and thirteen. And he picks up yet another win. There's the averages. O'Shea again up round the 99 averages. I think he lost a match with a, a 99. Well, this time he wins one. Right, we're going to be straight back with Sean McDonald against Robert Thornton. to match number 13 of 15. So three more games to bring you. This is the fifth cycle of five in Group A. And we will get a look at the table and see how that win for O'Shea affected his position in Group A. There we go. Keelan K unstoppable so far today. Thornton on six points. And now O'Shea... Leapfrogs Burnett into third spot. 
Kevin Burness in fifth, and McDonald played four, lost four. I don't see him getting too much out of this one, if I'm honest. A bit more on that weekend in Gibraltar. Young Caden Smith picked up the first leg. It's Sean to throw first. JDC Game Virtual on. World Junior Championships. And he went on to won the obviously as I mentioned won the Gibraltar Open Youth event, and then his dad Gavin Smith went on to win the mad ranked Gibraltar Open title, 53. beating Mike Norton in the final. Mike Norton, you may remember, had darts to beat Raymond Van Barneveld in the UK Open a couple of years ago. As we continually tease him, of course, he absolutely choked it. One hundred and thirty four. All banter, Mike. All banter. He's a good lad. From my neck of the woods. Sixty. One hundred and thirty four. Thirty. Sixty. Well, that performance, and it was, it was below par against Keelan Cave from Robert Thornton. I mean, Sean he did put it right in the match against Burnett. He played very, very well. But now he's sort of dipped again into this, well, I don't know what it is. I do, but I best not say it on air. We'll get told Game off. Shot on the first leg. But a good Sean finish McDonald. from McDonald. And he wins the opening leg with the darts. And Robert Thornton's Second form is, is of concern. Well, his inconsistency is of concern. 96. That 120 checkout was of a 15 dart hold there for Sean. He did play much better in his last match. Remember, he averaged in excess of 90, I think 60. over 92 against Keelan K. Yeah, it was 92.13 in defeat. But it was a much, 58. much better performance. So last time out against Burnett, Robert Thornton averaged 87 and change, but his performance in the match before was 74.12. And his match before 60. that, he averaged 96. He has been seriously up and down today. One hundred and forty. But still has. Incredible game in the locker, of course. Burnett against O'Shea to follow. And then Keelan Kay against Burness. Can Kay make it five out of five? I don't think so. I just don't like the two to five about Kevin Burness. Well, he was this morning. I should 60. imagine that shortened on the back of... Keelan Kay's performances today. Yeah, 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 well, he's eight to thirteen favourite. Keelan Kay six to five. Ninety-seven. Robert, you require one hundred and forty-seven. One 
Game shot on the second leg. Robert More like Morton. it. A one four seven. So the maximum in snooker. Not quite the maximum in darts, of course. That's one seventy. But it is the second highest finish we've seen today. Oh, it's Sean to throw first. Seen a Game 160 on. from Keelan K. Now seen a 147 to back up the 120 in leg one from McDonald. Both one in 15 Big darts nine. and both holds of throw. Well, O'Shea is 8 to 11 to beat Burnett. Well, on the back of what I've just 60. seen, that doesn't look too much of a silly bet. Like I say, the Keenan K, Kevin Burness. I just think that's a bit skinny, isn't it? 8 to 13 against a man who's only won one match all day. His favourite to beat a guy that's won four. <coughs> I do agree with him, obviously, but I just hoped for the punters. It was a bit bigger. Welcome back, Robert. One hundred and twenty six. Forty five. One hundred. Eighty-one. Sean, you require seventy-six. Even despite a one-eighty in the match, you see, either side of it, it's just ordinary. And that's given McDonald a go here at seventy-six to lead two-one. Fifty-six. So I should be going ball here. Twenty-five leaves one ten. One hundred and thirty-five. Should be trouble twenty and ball. And that's a good guide. Oh, just lost the line. That's that 25 is perfect. You basically just aim 59. at that dart and then just bump in the ball off of it. Sean, you require 20. 59. No score. He's just slipped in to double 12, Robert, you unfortunately. 76. Game shot on the third leg. Uh, Robert Thornton. 18 dart breaker throw for Robert. Again, courtesy of that 180, but that is a leg that's got away for McDonald, even even though the fourth 180 leg. was it's hit Robert by Robert in Game leg on. three. It was the chances and the mistakes 81. from McDonald allowed Thornton back in at that 76. Still a good kill. And a good clean finish, of course. Seventy nine. Forty five. Seventy-seven. Robert was my fancy at six to one to win Group A. He's going to have to find a bit more consistency. Ninety six. One hundred and eighty. 
two. Beauty number two. Good timing yet again from Chocolate. Thirty-three. Robert, you require one hundred and sixty. Twenty-eight. And follows that up with twenty-eight. One hundred and twenty-five. Robert, you require one hundred and thirty-two. Trouble nineteen would have left the pool. One hundred and four. That leaves double fourteen. So pressure on the ninety-one. Sean, you require ninety-one. Should be going ball. If you hit a twenty-five, it leaves sixty-six. So sixteen and ball. Trouble sixteen leaves double nine. 73. Robert, you require 28. 78. Game shot on the fourth leg. Robert what a Thornton. fabulous final dart for Robert Thornton to hold throw. There's nothing worse than breaking throw and then... Not holding, of course. Well, Robert did hold. He leads 3-1. Yet again, McDonald keeps finding Game himself on. too far adrift. Fifty-eight. One hundred and forty. Ninety nine. Ninety nine. Yeah, again, forty three. Bizarre leg from Thornton, twelve darts thrown. Only three hundred, uh, sorry, two hundred and eighty four scored. He's having a right old chunter to himself in the back. 100. 100. Not sure these two will know too much about each other. Sean, you require 100. Certainly not met in the, uh, in the live league. May have met in exhibitions in Scotland. Game shot on the oh, field. Robert there. was Sean McDonald. nodding in the background. Maybe he knows. I don't know. He was almost assured the double ten was going to go in, and it did. And that's Sick another ton plus Robert finish for Sean McDonald. Took out the 120, of course, in leg one. Adds to that tally 
with 140. 100 checkout in leg five. was another poor leg from Thornton. But he started this one with a 140. Can he kick on? Can he close the show? 140. Back to back 140s. Robert does have the opportunity, of course, to move on to eight points to join Keelan K. He won't top the group. Irrelevant of what happens. 54. But he could join, like I said, Keenan K on eight points. One hundred. Robert, you require one hundred and sixty seven. Well, two trouble twenty here, leave double sixteen. Oh, 95. Close. Very, very close for Thornton. Doesn't want to get embroiled in a match here, Thornton. And, of course, winning 4-2 will be plus 2 on the leg 98. difference. Robert, you require 72. Two twelves. Game, shot, and, and the Thornton match. there, Robert celebrates Thornton. a 15 dart. Hold a throw, gets the job done, 4-2, and he does join Keelan K on eight points. Tidy enough averages, 85 for Thornton, 86-84. Another decent showing from Sean McDonald. He really has improved as the day's gone on, just not got any results. Right up next, our penultimate match, and it's a good one. John O'Shea versus Richie Burnett. And welcome back. All Scottish Fair ended 4-2 in favour at Thornton. I'm sure they're going to be both off enjoying the kickoff at 2 o'clock. Once again, good luck to Scotland and all the supporters. I'm not actually sure if supporters are allowed in to watch. I hope so. But there you go. Keenan K, 8 points plus 5. Robert Thornton, 8 points plus... Sorry, Keenan K, 8 points plus 8. Thornton, eight points plus five. They're dominating on John day one. But a chance for O'Shea. 
to move on to six points. 93. Try and claim third spot. Well, they're both in that position here. O'Shea and Burnett. I think O'Shea wins this one. So in Paul's Burnett. We're the max. Of course. And just for me, O'Shea has been 96. the better of the two over the course of the day. I can back that up with facts and figures. Like I say, I try and leave opinion out of this stuff. 60. The beauty of our sport, you see, it produces numbers. 81. Lots of them. I say, oh, O'Shea's been the better player of the two today. I can back that up, which is why I said it, because I'm looking at the facts in front of me and all the stats, and it all stacks up. 100. Richie, you require 121. Bullseye. Game shot Brilliant leg of darts leg. from Richie Burnett. Burnett. A 180 to open the throw and then finishes it off with a 121 on the bullseye for a 12 dart breaker throw. Superstar from Richie's Burnett. First. Game on. Outstanding. One hundred and eighty. Where does this come from? Eighty-one. John O'Shea. His first match, ninety point eight nine, losing four two. Brunette. One hundred and forty. Oh, deep. 90.62 uh, with a 4 2 win over Sean McDonald. And then Burnett lost 4 3 with a 93.19. O'Shea lost 4 3 with a 99.38. And Burnett won with an 87.67. And O'Shea won with a 97.58. 100. And Burnett lost with an 84.67. O'Shea won with a 99.44. Do you see the pattern? 85. Richie, you require 81. Statistically, a better player, or the better player so far today, by a long way. But Burnett tearing up. Tearing up the stats at the moment. Could have been back-to-back back 12s had O'Shea been somewhere there or thereabouts. But Burnett not risking it with him back on 195. And rightly so. 130. Richie require 51. I don't like that play. To leave 65, you're going to go for the ball. And if you hit a ball, which is what you're aiming at, you're going to be disappointed. I don't think you can see any of that, Richie, can you? Nip one pearl one, son. Game brilliant. The second layer. Absolutely Richie brilliant Burnett. from Burnett. Actually bent it around there. I think that's what he's trying to say. He got his back bent round and managed to find an angle, almost curled the dart in. It's John to throw first. He needs 2-0. Just 27 darts used to win the opening two legs. 12 and 15. 100. There's no quit in O'Shea, that's for sure. 60.
140. One of my most emphatic wins at the World Match Play against Richie Burnett, winning 10 1. 140. Not long joined the ranks of the PDC then. One hundred and thirty-nine. Not that I remind them of it very often. One hundred and forty. Richie require one hundred and twenty-two. Trouble eighteen leaves ball. Well, if you'll stay there, trouble eighteen for double sixteen. Could go ball for double eighteen. Yep, sixty one. He John, you require forty. Tops for two one and a hold of throw. Potential fourteen darter now. Game shot on the third and then leg. it goes. This John is a O'Shea. real high quality game so far. A twelve dart breaker throw was followed by a fifteen dart hold for Burnett to give him a two nil lead. And then O'Shea leg, has held in first. 14. Game on. <coughs> Both players. Well, Burnett 110. O'Shea 105 at the moment. 140. <coughs> 57. One hundred and eighty. Burnett here on absolute fire. One forty followed by a one eighty, his third of the match. Ninety two. His record is a hundred and nine point something. That's seriously under threat. He's averaging one hundred and seventeen right now. 136. 60. Richie, you require 45. Double 16 for an 11. Ooh. John O'Shea is just a spectator player, at the moment. That's a 12 dart hold of throw for Burnett. Winning legs 12, 15, 12 for Burnett. Fifth leg, the one John there first. from Game O'Shea on. was one in 14. Unplayable at the moment, Burnett, averaging 118.63. O'Shea averaging 97. Brilliant from Burnett, this. Vintage Burnett. 100%. This is literally how he used to play in the 90s. Everything used 16. to be best of five, and you'd see him go up and do exactly this. Go 12, 12, 12, 15, 12, 12, 15, 14, 13. Of course, we didn't keep, we didn't have the facilities to, to keep averages, and, and in fact... 96. You know, they weren't important. It's a bit like records. They're for DJs. It's about names on your... Putting, getting your names on trophies. 54. 59. Hello. The only time you ever thought about averages was when you were playing Super League or County at tournaments. It was never a, it was never even something that was discussed. One hundred and twenty-five. There was never a prize for the highest average. There was always a prize for the highest 100. finish, a bonus for a one seventy and. A nine darter, etc. Lowest leg, or but there was never anything. 
98. Never anything for the highest average of the day. Because we didn't keep them. One hundred. Shake grafting away Pitching down to eighty six. Almost fitting if Burnett can take this out. It would have finished off an absolute blinder. Burnett going the new school way 99. on. Ninety nine. John, you require sixty four. Six nineteens and ball. Single leaves the bullseye. That leaves double seven. Game that shot leaves absolutely player. nothing. John O'Shea. And that's an 18 dart hold of throw for O'Shea to close the gap to one. But this time, Burnett has the darts. Can he close it out? Flag. It's Richie to throw first. Game on. Eighty one. One hundred. Ninety six. Man on the top of the table, Keelan K. He's up 45. next against Burness, and that will be our final match of the day. Don't forget the PDC start starts at two o'clock on PDC.tv and the football on BBC or ITV, whichever you prefer. I presume it's on both. Don't quote me. One hundred. It's a fourth one eighty for Burnett. One hundred and forty-four. And once one four four. It's a little shake of the head. As Burnett was piling in that 180 from O'Shea. 60. Just to say, give it up, man. <laughs> give me a go. Uh, I don't think you're going to get one. 100. Richie, you require 84. Two 12s. Two sixes to finish it off with a 15 dart hold. Game shot. And a 15 and dart hold Richie it is. Burnett. A very, very good performance. Performance of the day coming from Burnett. I'm sure we're going to have a look at the averages. If my director can press the right button. And there you go. 106.67. Four 180s for Burnett. And look at that finishing. 57.14%. And a high finish, which was in leg one. A one to one remember. I thought O'Shea was going to win that one. All the stats certainly pointed in that direction. But nobody but nobody expected a 107 average from Burnett. But he produced. Can Keelan Kay produce in our final match against Kevin Burness? That's coming straight up. Good afternoon and welcome back to our final match of week four in Group A. Uh, Keelan K currently tops the table on eight points, winning four out of his five matches. Robert Thornton also 
won four out of his five. His only defeat came at the hands in a bizarre performance against Keelan K. I fancy Burness in this one. What a, what a performance that was First from Richie Burnett. 106.67 on the average. He's looking good. One hundred. Highest average of the day, that 167. High finish of the day, a 160 from Keelan K. Sixty. Almost no one else today is it four one eighties in a single match. We had three from Keelan K in one match. We had three from Burnett in match number two. We had three from John O'Shea in match five, and that was in defeat. Incredibly, in, de in defeat. Yeah. One hundred eighty. Burnett finding a max. Ninety nine. Sixty. Performance of the day from Burnett, without a doubt, but player of the day has to be this man, Keelan K. One hundred and forty five. Yeah, one seventy earlier to leave tops, didn't he? Fifty-seven. Keelan, you require sixty-five. Tops. Game shot on the Tops first he leg. gets. Keelan he is Cone. unstoppable today. That's a 14-dart hold of throw, despite the 180 from Burness. Burness didn't even get a sniff at a double. Can Second Keelan gets Kevin to throw go first. through the card. Game on. If you'd have said to me today he was going to go through the card unbeaten, Sixty-one. Probably checked what you were drinking. If you had a tab on, I'd have checked what you're smoking. Kevin's last score was sixty-one. Eighty-five. Just adjusting the scores. They're somewhere near having the issue resolved. One hundred. One hundred. One hundred and thirty nine. One hundred. Thirty-eight. Kevin, you require one hundred and forty. <coughs> Eighty-two. Right, left fifty-eight. Kevin, you require one hundred fifty-eight. For Keenan K, is that a 160? I can't take the 158 out. It's going to try and leave it as close 58. as possible. Kevin, you 58 require 58. for Burness. Game shot on the second leg. And Kevin Burness, Burness levels things up with an 18 darter. It was a 14 dart hold in leg one for Keenan K. 
An 18 dart hold for Burness in leg Third two. Leg. It's Keelan to throw first. Game on. One hundred and eighty. Second one eighty of the match. One apiece now. One hundred and forty. Thirty eight. Fifty-five. One hundred and seventy-seven. Fifty-eight. Keelan, you require one hundred and six. I don't really find any kind of form on the on the Keelan K throw at the moment, Burness. I don't know if he's conscious of it. Or it's just not happening. One hundred and forty. Keelan, you require forty eight. Two one. Game yeah, shot. No the problem at all. Keelan for K. Keelan K, his two holds of throw have both been won in 14 darts. Going along very nicely here. An average of over 102 for Keelan K. Fourth leg, it's Kevin to throw first. Game on. He's, he's just not going to be denied. 100. 140. 100. 140. Back to back 140s for Keelan K. Closing in on our first break of throw of the match. I have to say, I fancied Burness for this one. 100. More so, just waiting for the pressure of the situation on Keelan K. And for Kevin Burness to actually. 100. Keelan require 121. Not anywhere near to the level we've seen him play at. The live league. Although 85. credit has to be given to K, he's not letting Kevin, him. you require 101. Two twelves has to go. 77. Oh dear, right on the wire. Super effort. Keelan, you require but that was just 36. a hold. <coughs> 36. Game shot on the fourth well, leg. I Keelan don't K. know what Keelan K has been doing. Since his last day at the, or last week at the live league. Fifth leg, it's Keelan uh, to throw Whatever he's first. been doing. Game on. I would like to know the secret. Three winning legs so far. 140. All been one in 14 so far in this match. Averaging 102. 140. Trading 140s at the open. Opening two visits of leg five. Burness is averaging 91. And getting absolutely spanked here. 44. And he was moving his wrist around a little earlier. That looked a little uncomfortable as well. So if he is carrying some form of injury, he doesn't look happy. 100. 
140. One hundred and forty. Keelan, you require seventy eight. Seventy two. To match darts for Keelan. Kevin, you require one hundred and seventeen. To save it. Tops. Wow, what a finish. And a 15 dart breaker throw with a 117 finish there for Burness. Keeps this one alive. Can he hold throw and take us to a decider? Sixth leg, it's Kevin to throw first. Game on. Absolutely brilliant finish under pressure. So two match darts for 100. Keelan. One at double 12, one at double six. 58. What a day Keenan Kay has had so far. I said best I've seen him play by a long, long way, especially consistent, consistently 95. across the day. 59. Keenan's had averages of 88. 87.42. Eighty-five. Fifty-six. Ninety-one point four eight. Sixty. One hundred eighty. I don't know why he's slightly despondent he's more than in this match or maybe it's just out of 60 oh. Kevin you require where, that, where has that been all day why am I in this position at 3 2 down that leaves 25 so 9 for double 8 back to back 15 darters Game shot on the certainly line. is back Kevin to back Bernays. checkouts a 117 followed by a 70, and they're both one in 15 darts. We're going to a decider. He was in complete Seventh control, and wasn't he? 3 1. First. Game on. Kevin won the. Op uh, sorry, Keelan won the opening leg. Then Kevin held. And 100. Then Keelan K moved 3 1 up with back to back 14 darters. Kevin's responded. Back to back 15s. 125. 57. Well, a two trouble visit here. And Burness could take control. 140. 125, followed by a 140. His to lose from here. One hundred and forty. Unless, unless he hits a one eighty. <laughs> one forty is not too shabby. One hundred and forty. Oh, what a super leg. One two five, one forty, one forty. When you have to in a deciding leg against the darts and your opponents matching 140. you. One hundred and forty. Kevin, you require ninety six for the match. Well, for an eleven darter. 78. Not two match darts for Burness. He can't believe it. Keelan, you require Burness. 64. Neither. We're particular, particularly close. 1 one dart at tops. Game oh, shot. What a blessed day he Keelan has play. had. I don't quite know how he's won 5 out of 5, but he has won 5 out of 5. And Keelan K tops the table there's the averages yet again one of keelan's opponents had a higher average but is on the wrong end of the w a great day for keelan k a great day's action and a high average of 106.67 from brunette being the highlight but player of the day belongs to keelan k we're back tomorrow morning 
9.30am. Enjoy the darts, enjoy the football and enjoy the sun. See you tomorrow.